guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing my drugstore essentials. All these stuff that I use from the drugstore for my body, and for my face, and for all that type of stuff. And I'm really excited for this video because I would say I'm a pretty minimalistic girl, but I do enjoy my beauty products from the drugstore. Alright, anyways, let's get started. So anyways, starting from the top down, I'm going to start with the Pantene 2-in-1 Smooth Shampoo and Conditioner. Now, I love this stuff. I mentioned this in my hair care routine, which I will link below. And I love it because I am all about efficiency. I don't want any unnecessary products. Moving down, let's talk about the face, which has the most products, so I will just get started. The first thing is the Neutrogena Deep Clean Facial Cleanser. Now, I really do like this cleanser. I think it is a very basic cleanser. It can remove makeup, but I usually use my Pond School Cream first. And I think it just gets my face really clean. I use this by itself in the morning, and then I use it with my Clarisonic in the evening. Talking about Pond's Cold Cream, I another one of my essentials is the Pond's Cold Cream Cleanser. This is just perfect for those nights when you are not in the mood to do a full out skincare routine. So I just go ahead and use some of this. Next, I have my Pond's Dry Skin Cream, which I absolutely love. This is was in my January favorites, I believe. And I love this stuff. I've been using this for a few weeks now, and I have like hardly made a dent in it, if you can see, because this is packed with products. Next, one of my drugstore essentials that's always in my cabinet is Vaseline. Now, Vaseline is just petroleum jelly, it is just amazing. I just use this for my lips and on those no makeup days, I'll usually just use it for my eyebrows and my lashes and my lips. Next on to drugstore makeup, the first thing is this e.l.f. pressed powder. This is really, really old. I am in the color Spice though and I bought this online so I didn't know if it would be considered a drugstore but I just decided to mention it. It's like a dollar I think so I think it's a really good deal. Next, I might have should have mentioned this in skincare, but this is the Burt's Bees Beeswax Lip Balm. I love this stuff. I feel like it like plumps out my lips. It is just a lip balm, so it is so amazing. I think the mint just helps to like pump out your lips, and I really really like it. Next, this is the Maybelline Pumped Up Colossal mascara now I have mentioned this so many times this is just one of my all-time favorite mascaras it just gives me the best lashes it's like the brush is big and voluminous and it is definitely one of my favorites lastly what I've been using on top of my lip balm lately is this Revlon Super Lustrous Lipstick in um, what that is? 423, which is pink velvet. And when you put it on, like over a lip balm or over Vaseline, it just gives the prettiest pink color. I cannot wear this full out, but I think it is a really, really beautiful color. Now, moving on to body, I just have like two things. And first is the Pure Silk raspberry shaving cream it's just shaving cream you know I don't really have a preference um, it's wet because I just took it out of the shower but yeah I, th I think it's decent next is one of my lifesavers after shaving I always use this this is the baby oil usually it's from like Johnson & Johnson but we just got like the little like drugstore like alternative the drugstore brand and I love this stuff because it's just so hydrating. It's basically pure mineral oil, and I'm a big fan of mineral oil. But um, yeah, I think this is such a good product, and I really, really recommend it. All right, that is all for my drugstore essentials. I hope I helped you in case you're making a trip to the drugstore soon on what products to get. All right, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Tell you once what I could say again and again and again
and again and again and again And I know you want to tell me what you think of what I say I promise you that I will give you time later to weigh in To weigh in if you want to If you want to But I forgot to tell you I was heading out to take my puppy for a walk And then the strangest little thing came out and ran across the sidewalk It might have been a squirrel or a chipmunk or a prairie dog But something about the tail wasn't right that's another story. Everyone just stopped and stared with blank expressions, motionless. For a second, everything was silent and commotionless. I turn, I said to Fluffy, that's a cute little sire day. But then it went scampering off, and that was better than the empty spaces in the air. Fill it up, fill it up, fill it up, oh no, oh no.